This video demonstrates transmission from McLernan's MPS system to PriceGrid. Upon logging into the PriceGrid system, we can see that our current order list is empty. As you can see, there's no products in the current order. Moving to the McLernan's MPS system, we look at our generic order list. Upon selecting either the generics list or the PI list, you must make sure that the supplier is selected as PriceGrid. If PriceGrid isn't an option, please contact customer care at pricegrid.co.uk or McLernan's. All products being transmitted require a valid PIP code, and if you have a product with no PIP code, you have several options. A different manufacturer of the same product can be selected and select one of the products with a valid PIP code. Alternatively, a new manufacturer can be selected from within the order screen. When you're happy with the order, select Send within MPS. An order will transmit from MPS direct to price grid. A transmission report will show the number of lines ordered and any shorts, in this case 60. Shorts simply mean the PIP code has not been recognised. This may be because the product is not supplied through price grid or the PIP code is invalid. When we now select our current order, we can see that the transmitted order is now in price grid and it's ready to be priced. To price the order, simply select Price Order. When we price the order, we can see that the 60 lines we transmitted have all been priced.